Hello everyone, I'm the Salty Hyena and we're checking out the new Titan Bully. It has been around for a while, even though it hasn't actually been able to be purchased by players. You could win it in events and stuff, but it wasn't very good and it needed a rework. The rework is here, it's called an Ansil. It's the shield we're currently looking at. It's a pretty beautiful shield, if I may say so myself. Uh, it's divided into nine parts that has individual hit points. So, uh, in like different parts of it can be destroyed individually. If you destroy the center, the whole shield gets destroyed. It has four upgrade slots, so you can um, build it the way you want it to. And it affects the speed of the bully differently depending on how you build it. Personally, I've gone for a mix between heavy and light AFPS resistance because I anticipate mostly to be up against AP damage. And now we're gonna check out some in-game footage from a 5 vs 5 I had earlier today. Uh, most of this footage gonna, is gonna be sped up because most of it it's just running around. Because it's a light titan and it has a sprint, it's really freaking fast and as such it's really good for capping spawn points or you know, running around to find where uh, the convoy is in, in Steel Convoy. For those of you who don't know what Steel Convoy is, it's a different game mode than Team Deathmatch. I'm gonna make a video about it, so stay tuned to my channel. And check out this section here. Notice that Sean over there, going for my teammate. And he spent his EMPs, I was reasonably sure that he couldn't take me on. But now his guns are online, and I'm turning my shield to intercept his fire while I'm retreating. Suddenly I'm getting fired upon from a different angle, so <laughs> I'm turn turning my shield that way because you can see these are missiles. A few of them has hit me and my chest is already red. But you know, the shield <laughs> really freaking useful. So you can uh, you can really, really do a lot of stuff with that shield, like approach titans that normally would hobble you, etc. Of course, your legs are gonna be a bit um, vulnerable. <laughs> so uh, I wouldn't really advise you to charge people <laughs> with this. But it, it's... I, I don't know how to... to uh, properly evaluate this Titan yet because this metagame is so new and lots of people hasn't really uh, picked up on how to fight against it or even fight with it. But it's really useful especially with you know uh, the Vulcan. Check out this section by the way. In a 2 versus 1 the 2 will always win. Always. Well, of course, unless you really mess up or something. But uh, um, as I was saying, with a Vulcan, the bully is really, really um, useful. Because the Vulcan is pretty deadly up close, and that's one of the major things that the bully has always lacked. So, uh, you can run it with a hammer as well. Uh, it's not used less with a hammer. And uh, with the Sarissa, you will <laughs> you, you will miss a lot. Notice how my chest is gone, but my shield is still good. With a single shot that passes my shield kills me. So this has been, been the bully with the Ansel. Thank you for watching. See you next time.